Hey everyone, so today I thought I would do something a little bit different. I am going to do a high school survival kit. And all I mean by this, I don't know if this is a relevant name for the title of the video, I hope it is, but basically it's just something I used to do when I went to high school. And it's just like a whole lot of little bits and pieces that I used to take with me in my handbag or in my school bag just for like you know, just in case situations. If you want to be that friend that everyone can count on, that's always got something that people need and that's that's always got something handy, you need to put one of these together. So basically I just chucked all of the things that I am talking about today in a little, um, I guess it's like a makeup bag, you could use like a little pencil case, whatever you want, whatever you have. You can use something smaller than this as well if you want because some of the stuff I have in here is quite big. But even so, this whole thing only weighs probably maybe 200 grams, 300 grams, because um, I know how much it matters when you go to high school, you've got all those heavy books to lug around. Every little gram in your bag matters, so yeah, this isn't too heavy, so you don't have to worry about that. And if you've got a big bag, it's not going to take up too much space, but yeah, you can definitely use something smaller. So first of all, because I wear glasses slash contacts, I have a pair of spare glasses in here. Um, I can't tell you the amount of times my contacts just absolutely killed my eyes and I was just really thankful to be able to just grab my glasses out and take those things out and just relax my eyes a bit. Um, so if you are a glasses wearer, you want to put them in there or if you wear contacts, it's just a really good idea to have some backup visionary devices. By the way, these are... what brand? These are Ray-Bans. These are actually quite affordable. Um, they look like this. <laughs> While we're on this theme, I'll also show you, I always bring an extra contact. Um, you know how it is, if you wear contacts, you know, getting some dust in your eye or something, or your contact just irritating your eye, sometimes it's just too old and you need to change it. Um, sometimes your contact can like break, that's happened to me a couple of times, so it's always good just to have a spare backup contact. Same thing goes just wherever you are, like no matter if you're high school or not. It's so good having one of these in your like purse or in your car or anything like that. I always have spare contacts lying around. Also some eye drops, whether you wear contacts or not, they're real handy at school when you're focusing on things for a really long amount of time and you just want to like kind of refresh your eyes a bit. Eye drops work wonders um, and they're just really hydrating and refreshing and stuff. And also everywhere I go I always bring a little contacts case and I always make sure that it's of course got some liquid inside of it. So as I say if I need to take out my contacts for any reason at all I can just take them out and pop them in here and they'll be safe and good to go. Next I also have a little mirror. This one here is a Leo Ali one but obviously you can definitely find one smaller than this but this is like the smallest one I could find. Um, so <laughs> chuck that in there. I'm not the kind of person that carries makeup around. Um, unless it's just like my lip product because whatever lipstick I'm wearing I'll just chuck in my bag. But one makeup product I always found helpful having lying around was concealer. And the reason it's so good is like if you're wearing sunglasses and your makeup comes off your nose you can always just touch up with a little bit of concealer. Um, if it wipes off around your nose, if you blow your nose, around your mouth you can just touch up, touch up, touch up. Um, and I just think it's really handy and a lot more convenient than carrying around like a massive foundation bottle. This one here is called Cover All Mix by Makeup Store and I love it. So yeah. And then lip balm. It's always handy to have lip balm. If not for you, one of your mates might be desperate for it. So this one here is really good if you're going to be sharing because you can just like wash your hands and like have some and it's not like going lip to lip, you know. This is the Nivea Lip Butter in Vanilla and Macadamia. It's my favourite one from this line. Smells so good. Or if you just want something for yourself, her all lip balms are my ultimate favourite. This one here is the night treatment one, but I just really like it because it's really, really, really moisturising. I can guarantee you, one day during high school, during your years, at least one time, you or one of your friends is going to be desperate for one of these. A liner, a pad, or a tampon. So it's always good just to have a couple of spares in your bag, um, just for any, you know, un unforeseen experience. You know what I'm trying to say, it's always really handy to have them lying around and if it doesn't help you out, it'll definitely help one of your friends out at some stage. This is a random, but I used to carry around a bit of tooth floss, I was going to say toothpaste, tooth floss. You never know when you're going to need it, sometimes, you know, when you're eating your lunch and stuff, it's just, it's just better to have it there just in case and it makes you feel a lot cleaner. Um, you know, just being able to like floss your teeth or whatever. Same goes for mints or you could take gum, I prefer mints. They're just really good to have during the day if you feel like you need a bit of a, 
spruce up or one of your friends if you need to hint to someone. <laughs> hair tie. Always, always bring a hair tie with you. If you don't need it, one of your friends will. Especially during gym class and everything, I always forgot to like tie up my hair on gym day, so it was always good having a spare in my bag. Same with bobby pins. They are always handy. A little bit of something for if you're not feeling like you smell that good or something. <laughs> These perfumes are really handy to chuck in your bag just because they are really small. Um, they don't take up much room at all and they don't weigh anything. This is a Taylor Swift Made of Starlight Musical Edition and Taylor by Taylor Swift like, I don't know, what do you call it? It's like a mini um, perfume with a little roller ball and then you can just like roll it onto your wrists or wherever. Yum. Hand cream. This is a rather big hand cream for a bag. Um, I would normally take something smaller but this was the smallest one I could find. You definitely can find like really mini ones. This is one of my favourite ones. It's the Orly Rich Renewal Paradise Lychee and Pomegranate scent and it's so good and it, it hydrates so well and it doesn't leave your hands feeling oily. Something I used to do during high school, I like, you'd just be sitting there in a boring class listening to the teacher. It's always good just to have something to keep you occupied. Good to moisturise your hands and just, it's just handy. <laughs> Band-aids, always, always take band-aids with you. Even if it's not for a cut or anything, it's always good for if someone gets blisters or something like that. Panadol, really good, of course, if you get a random headache during school, one of your friends does, or, you know, period pain or anything like that, it's always really, really handy to have them. Strepsils or throat lozenges, whatever you call them from where you're from. Um, throat lozenges are really good to have with you. I just cut one off and just pop it in there because I cannot tell you how many times during high school, especially during winter, um, I would come up with a random sore throat during the day, so it's always just really nice to have something to soothe your throat. I always, always, always keep like an extra dollar or two um, in one of these little kits. They're really, really handy if you need to like grab a bus somewhere after school, or if you forgot all of your lunch money, or if one of your friends needs a bus, or parking money, or whatever, whatever. It's just good to have a little bit of change lying around. So that is everything that is in my little high school survival pack, slash you could use this whether you're in normal school, or uni, or adult life. <laughs> what would you pack in yours? Let me know if you think I missed something. Let me know down below in the comments and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please thumbs up if you did. I just thought I'd do something a little bit different and yeah have a really amazing day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!